Hey guys, welcome back to another video. We're here today in the Eurofighter. As you guys can see, we have an SA-3 site way on the other side of these mountains. Uh, pretty far down there, and uh, our objective today is going to be to knock out that uh, SA-3 site. The problem is that right now, right off the nose, there's a couple of MiG-31s who would like to deny that airspace, if you will. Now fortunately for me, I have meteor missiles that are going to help me in this scenario. I have six meteor missiles, so that should be plenty to deal with anything that we encounter on the way in. Uh, the SA-3 is part of a base essentially, so we have harms as well, which we're going to hit them. And essentially the idea is that we want to deliver a cluster munition right onto that base and knock out that SA-3. Got this guy locked up here. Lost it. Stand by. Gonna send a nice juicy meteor at this MiG-31. They see me too, they're, they're locking me. So we'll have to defend here. Uh, this looks pretty good, I would say. Fox 3. MiG-31, flown by real people, by the way. All of these videos are flown with real people, guys. AI is just not smart enough to really do what we need. <laughs> that meteor missile is guiding. I don't seem to have been shot at. It seems. Maybe I did, I don't know. Broke the lock. Recommitting those on. You can see my meteor missile really going right at him there. And we're going to defend precautionary right here, head into this valley just in case, because there's another guy too. There's two MiG-31s here. The beauty of the Meteor Missile is I can just kind of leave it and it seems to find its own target. So if I can just send it in that general direction, theoretically it'll find something to hit. Uh, I guess the problem is like, is it the guy you want to hit or not? Here's a, the other MiG-31 here. I don't know what happened to the first guy, but there doesn't seem to be anything on radar, so I assume he's dead. Uh, go ahead and send a Fox 3 at this guy. Fox 3, there it goes. And he's locking me too, once again we'll defend. That Meteor should do its thing. Meteor is the, the great equalizer, man. Okay, into the valleys here to try to survive in case that guy shot at me. These MiG-31s, the fact is that I got pretty close to them and that's a big reason why. They're kind of somewhat easy to deal with. Uh, from a long distance I think the MiG-31s would have been a much bigger problem. I don't know what's going on, I, I, I think that guy's possibly dead now. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna head over there and see what's going on. Alright, as we get closer to the SA-3 site, there's a bunch of helicopters, slow movers, so I assume they're helicopters. And a couple of MiG-29s here, just got a meteor out on that guy.
I assume the MiG-29s are providing cover for the uh, helicopters over there that are hitting our ground objectives. Or, you know, friendlies on the ground. Lock this guy. There we go. That's the second MiG-29. Fox 3 on him. Hold this for me real quick, bud. <laughs> this giant meteor. His buddy is probably dead. Yeah, his buddy's dead. I see the smoke from his, his dead friend. And that guy will die. Yes, he just got hit by that meteor. Splash one. Alright, I don't know if these are KA-50s or if they are MI-24s, but it doesn't really matter. Fox 2. Didn't come off. Stand by. Fox 2. There it is. Okay. Got it. I was pressing the wrong button. And that did not track for some reason. Let's give him another one. Fox 2 again. And again that didn't track. Went for flares. It's one lucky KA-50 there. Fox 2 again. That guy not so lucky. There's a third guy. There's a fourth guy off in the distance over there. Fox 2. And Splash got him. So two KA-50s remain, and luckily, oh, I guess unlucky for them, I still have two Meteors remaining. So, <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> I'll be back. Are Meteors overkill for KA-50s? I don't know, probably. Doesn't matter though. <laughs> Fox 3. What's that poor guy gonna do? Imagine you're in a K-50 and you realize a meteor missile was just shot at you. And... Splash 1. Okay, the second guy is right there. Fox 3. And look at that, that's tracking perfectly. Poor guy. He doesn't even know it's coming. Bam! <laughs> Dead. Man, it's gotta be terrifying to uh, be in a bunch of K-50s and then just have a Eurofighter just tear through your entire formation. <laughs> <laughs> and just kill like half your buddies and then come back around and shoot meteors at you. Like that's horrible man. What a terrible way to die. <laughs> Alright we got the the SAM site up ahead. Uh, I have the harms pulled up so hopefully these do their job and they knock out the radar and then I can finish the job with the cluster munition. I can kind of see it should be right there. Alright. Uh, I hope this works because I don't want to have to gun this thing again like we did in the F-16 video. <laughs> I don't think I can do that again. Alright, let's uh, go ahead and send it. Magnum. And Magnum again. And he's locking me. Those harms look like they saw something, so they're, they're tracking something. I see no missile launch yet, which is good for me. Hopefully those harms can hit before he launches a missile. That would be ideal. Oh, never mind. Missile in the air. Okay, yeah, so I guess the harms didn't get there in time. Should we play chicken and just wait and see if the harms get there? No. I can't do that. It, that missile would hit me a second before the harms hit. Ooh. Hit a tree line there. Uh, I think the harms actually hit something. Okay. The harms hit something, but whatever they hit, that SA-3 is still locking me. So whatever they killed was not the correct thing. 
So we're gonna have to go in there and drop a cluster munition on that thing. Just fired at me again. Defending. Defending down here. There's that missile, it's coming in. Hit a tree again. Okay, let's go close. We can min range the SA3 or SA6, whatever that is over there. We've got to watch out for the AAA though. Alright, alright, come on, come on, come on, come on. There's a train right underneath me and coming in nice and low to avoid the AAA and we're going to pop up here. Let's go. There we go. Yeah. Okay, lots of AAA fire here. Drop the nose. Okay, and pickle, and pull away. Okay, uh, I think that was on target, that cluster munition. I think it was good. I think it was a good drop there. Still taking a lot of AAA fire. And yes, cluster munition is hitting on target. Look at that. Alright, there you go. That's pretty cool. It's a little bit of a Eurofighter multi-role scenario, I guess. Worked out pretty well. Good effect on target. Alright, let's get out of here.